today I'm going to show you how to create and edit a new post in WordPress so uh, first of all you have to go to your website and log in in your dashboard so first log in so after your login you you have to go to you have to create a new post so this is all your post in your website so this, this would be the dashboard you see uh, when you log in in your website first uh, this is the dashboard you will see for the first time in wordpress and then you have to you have to click here add uh, you have to click here add new from post add new then you will be able to create uh, and edit or format a post for for your blog this is the interface of the uh, editor here you in, in this section you put the title here and you put the main article here and here are all everything you need to edit your article or format your article and also you can select categories so that your articles fall into a, a good categories so let's do one for example so we are going to do we are going to format and edit this article this article is already been written so we are going to do it here so we are going to post the title here poet admission test 2017 so this is the title and then uh, we put the main article here Uh, so you can if you if you want to write you can write the article directly here uh, I, I I had this article written so I have just copy pasted it here if you want to write write an article then you can simply start from here you can continue like this you can write edit and do whatever you want here so let's do some editing so this is the article and this is there are some minor edit requests grammatical er edit requests uh, I have the Grammarly apps installed in my browser so it is showing me which are uh, which which grammatical things or typos I need to fix so let's fix them all first and then uh, and then we will we will do the other editing all right so um, so here we see we have an extra space here we, we fixed it and another extra space here we fixed it another extra space and you see requirements for application in web so we can we, we want to give it a title as a headline 2 we want we have placed it as a title uh, admission requirement of application in web uh, okay so we should put another word here admission application because there are other many other applications so we can put admission applicant so now this is heading to and and then uh, we have this number list here and we have another spacing problem now how to apply this is the headline uh, so we we have to give it another headline. We may give it heading three and center center it, and then the application system we can just highlight it by bold, making it bold. And here is another 
this we can we can also make it bold so this is it can you can do everything you do in your uh pretty much everything you can do you do in ms word uh we have to make them bold and centered so that people can easily understand what it is there is another thing seat plan so we have to we have to actually give it a headline uh, seat plan of wet admission test so that people can easily understand what are they going to read in here another thing here is contact details you can bold it maybe and then people can understand what it is so uh, this is pretty much all we have and now let's see how it looks like in in our website uh, this is the preview we are looking at this is we haven't published a save yet so this is the preview here the website we will add a photo here and also uh, also uh, I believe there are lots of other information to be added and we will add them soon uh, so also if we have to add the category this is this is an admission related uh, post so we have to select admission here as a category and then we can save it as a draft here uh, so that we can come back and edit again we can also uh, we can also add a featured image here uh, so pretty much it is you know, click you log in in your dashboard and then you click you click add new you add the title and the post you select category and you hit and you save it and and then you read it again you look at the preview from here you look at the preview if you think you need to change something you change it here even if we publish it let's say we want to publish it now and later you may we publish it here now and then uh, it will be live in your in our website the article will go live in our website and then if you decide to change something uh, after publishing the article uh, maybe uh, we have published it let's say here We have it published here now. Buet admission test is a short But see, no preview. We need to add an image here. So let's say we forgot to add the image now. How to how to add it again? Uh, you can do it from here. Also, you can do it from your dashboard. Uh, if you do it from here, simply go to Buet admission test, and then uh, you will see this edit. If you are logged in in your dashboard, then definitely you are going to see edit post. So if you click edit post, uh, you will go, you will come back here again, and then we can add the image. Uh, we can add the image from add media. We can click add media, upload file, and upload the file, and we can add it here. And um, also, if you decide to, uh, also you can see all your post here. If you click all post, you will see all the post you made here will be visible right, right under all post. Also, there are other things that we need to do for search engine optimization purpose, uh, which is uh, pretty much advanced thing. If you don't know what this is about, then you gotta learn it first, and then you can add it again. So this is it. Hope this helps. Thank you. If you need any more.
thing please let me know